Here comes number 21, Walker Buehler, leading them out. Ahead of his 15th start of the season. Walker Buehler has really struggled in the first inning. He has a 9 ERA in the first. Charlie Blackman, the DH, he's got great numbers in his career against Walker Buehler. He leads off. And this ball is hit well to center field, and it is off the base of the wall over the head of Tommy Edmond, and it's a leadoff double for Charlie. It's ball four, so the first two reach to start the game. And Blackman and Tovar move up on the wild pitch. But the Rockies take advantage. Base hit now could score two. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a fastball. One away. First strikeout for Bueller. Michael Tolia, home run number 25 last night, also had a two base hit. To Bueller, who grabs it. Blackman comes home and slides under Bueller's throw, and the Rockies take a one to nothing lead. A fielder's choice for Tolia. No error, but an RBI. Rockies in this series 0 for 6 with runners in scoring position because of that fielder's choice. Middle infield looking for two. Runners off the corners, and the pitch swung on. Foul tipped into the glove of Fiducia. He hangs on. That's strike three. Another strikeout, and it'll be left to Sam Hilliard. 27 pitch, top of the first for Bueller. He strikes out three. It dances between the raindrops, only allowing one run. Another rousing ovation at Dodger Stadium for Shohei Ohtani. Back home after making history, more history in Miami. Smoke to the left side, but right at McMahon, the third baseman, who was shifted over into shore. One and two on bets. On the outside corner, a delayed strike three. And the crowd doesn't like that's a great pitch. That's a 94 mile an hour fastball right there on the outside edge on the border. And Betts knew it. He didn't have an argument. He walked away quietly. That ball is going to be down for a hit trapped by Nolan Jones, the left fielder. He made a diving attempt and just trapped it. So Freddie's aboard with a two out single. And to Oscar Hernandez, who registered his 30th home run of the season last night. This is tapped towards short. And just in time from Tovar to Tolia to end the inning. Shatters his bat, bounces towards short. Rojas, throw is off the mark. That's going to be an infield single. The business end of the bat is out in short right field. The handle back near home plate. Lefties with a 965 OPS against Bueller this year. And it's caught by Rojas going back from short. Went to the top of the ladder and made the catch. And took a base hit away from Jake Cave. And that's inside. That got him. Yep, that skimmed his jersey, and he will get first base. Hit batsman by Walker Bueller, and that'll put Jones at second base. Stallings at first, and we turn the lineup over. Here's Ezekiel Tovar. He walked back in the first inning. It's pulled down the line. Extra bases. Jones will score. Stallings to third. He'll get a green light from Warren Schaefer. And the throw to the plate. Not going to get him. Two run double for Tovar, and he's now tied for the National League lead in doubles with Alec Bohm. An infield single and a hit batsman. They both come around to score. One gone, that'll bring up Max Muncy. Boy, that was nasty. That's the pitch I said it showed up earlier. He's definitely taking a little bit off of it. It's a little 12-6 breaker. You can see it right here. Fastball 94 95, the split at 85, and then you're spinning that one up there at 81. It's just so difficult for a hitter to cover. And a top rail fastball that'll end the inning. Three strikeouts in the game for Quantrill now to that inning. We'll go to the third. It's the Rockies three, Dodgers nothing. Bueller strikes out the side. Three up, three down. Walker Bueller with six strikeouts in the game. We'll head to the bottom of the third. It's the Rockies three, Dodgers nothing. He's taking all the way. A four pitch walk with two out. Yeah, we'll see if he runs here. Mookie Betts coming up. Betts struck out looking his first time up. 0 for 1 tonight. Two out in the bottom of the third. Otani on first. He's staying, and Mookie Betts cranks one to left field. Head deep. This ball is gone. Mookie makes it a 3 to 2 game. Marcus Lynn Betts heads around the bases. He'll touch home, getting Otani in. You know, Shohei scoring. On that homer, 126 runs now, five shy of the Dodger single season record. Jake Cave, the right fielder, 
Puts him away with a high fastball. Strikeout number seven. First pitch to Jacob Stallings, the catcher, club down to third. Good hop for Muncie. Throws on to first. And seven in a row now retired for Walker Bueller as he has another one, two, three inning. Ball four. Up and away. A one out walk for Max. The second walk issued by Quantrill. He walked Otani in the third right before Mookie Betts got him in with a home run. Gavin Lux rips the first pitch into right field. Muncie had to hold up the moment and make sure Rodgers. Wasn't there to catch a line drive, but it's first and second. Once he tags from second to third, so they'll be at the corners. Now the tying runs 90 feet away for Hunter Fiducia. Swung on, that's a ground ball into right, a base hit. He's tied it up. Muncie scores. Rumbling around second on his way to third with a pop-up slide is Gavin Lux. That is the first major league run batted in for Hunter Fiducia. And here comes the big show. 3-3 ball game. And Otani with the go-ahead run at third. Dodger Stadium waiting to erupt for another MVP moment from Shohei Otani. Fastball, see you later. Cal Quattro freezes. Shohei Otani to end the inning. Down at the knees on the middle of the plate, and Quantrill keeps the game tied. Walker Buehler has retired seven straight. Swing and a miss at a ball in the dirt. That's strike three. Padusha has to throw it down to first base to complete the strikeout. And Blackman strikes out. There's one away. Right side. Lux going back from second. Mookie coming in from right. It's Betts ball. Two away. McMahon will come up. Southern Cal native 0 for 2 a strikeout and a broken back ground ball to Freddie Freeman Bueller's first pitch to Mack is sent to left field going back Hernandez to the warning track to the wall it's gone Ryan McMahon for the fifth time in his career has a 20 home run season the Rockies regain the lead four to three count remains one and two for Bueller against Tolia. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. He extends his season high to nine strikeouts, but surrenders a go ahead home run. First pitch single to center field. Tying run on base to begin the fifth. He swung at the first pitch in the last two ABs. Two run home run, and now a lead single in the fifth. Rockies up four to three. Betts steals his 16th base of the season. The Dodgers have a tying run in scoring position. It's ball four to load the bases. And Bud Black wasting no time. And Gavin Lux with a pretty big at bat in this ball game. He won't face Quantrill. He's going to face the lefty Peralta. Bases full of Dodgers. Two outs. Gavin Lux, who singled his last time up. Swing and a miss at 97. He leaves him loaded. Luis Peralta. That's the pitch in the inning last night. Gave up a run. One hit, but struck out three. A one out, one on, and a 4-3 Rockies lead. And down on strikes goes Nolan Jones. Out number two, and Jake Cave, another left-handed hitter, coming up. On a 2-2 to Cave, Vesia goes back to the fastball, check swing, and he went around. So Vesia comes in, puts out the fire, strikes out two men. And that hit Otani. It did. He tried to spin all the way, got hit by a breaking pitch. And Shohei turned away more disappointed than upset. Chance now for the Dodgers. They've got the tying run in scoring position and the go-ahead run down at first base. And Mookie Betts is having a good night tonight coming up. To third, chance for two. There's one. Rodgers to first double play on one pitch. Inning ending double play just like that. And this is line to left center. It's going to get down. It goes off the glove of Teoscar Hernandez. Stallings will have a leadoff double. Outside ball four. Charlie Blackman draws the walk. First and second for the Rockies. Now two on for Tovar. Broken back ground ball up the middle. Lux is there. The flip to Rojas for one. The turn. In time. 4-6-3. The old two for one special for Honeywell in the seventh. Honeywell trying to strand Stallings. And he does. Fastball cut on. Foul tipped into the glove of Fiducia. He holds on for strike three. Ball four, a leadoff walk. Puts the tying run on first. Miguel Rojas 0 for 2, hit by a pitch last time. Swung on and missed. <laughs> the Bugs Bunny change. One out in the eighth inning. Fiducia 
There's one. Totally it back to the bag. Double play ends the inning. And that Rockies infield defense shuts the door on the Dodgers in the eighth. Cave turns on one, and this ball down the right field line is going to drop. Cave is going to head to second. Betts had trouble picking it up initially. It'll be a straight double. Two down, here's Blackman. It is 21st home run against the Dodgers last night. He's fifth among active players in home runs against L.A. Charlie's done it again against Daniel Hudson. This time he gives the Rockies a three-run ninth inning advantage. Dodgers are 3-52 and 52 when they trail after eight innings. Rookie Seth Halverson coming on looking for his first major league save, his ninth appearance. He's gone eight and two-thirds innings, has allowed one unearned run. And Otani swings, hits it to the gap left center field. That ball is going to get down past a diving Nolan Jones. And a long single for Otani, and the first man's on base. As Betts drives it to right, but there's plenty of room. Jake Cave will grab it for the out, and that's one down. Otani remains at first. Stolen base number 53 for Shohei Otani. And the Dodgers have loaded the bases. The tying run is at first, and the potential winning run coming to the plate. Again, the Dodgers down to their last strike. He's got him. For a second time in this game, the Dodgers leave him loaded and fall 6-3. to three. 